I'm really excited about this video because fascinating new research presented at the European Congress on Obesity in May 2022 has found a key to good health could simply lie in the timing of your last meal. Experts analysed 250 previous studies and found that fasting for at least 14 hours a day and limiting food intake between 6am and 3pm resulted in impressive results in overall health and weight loss. The researchers think this is because it works best with our circadian rhythm, our body clock, and is closer to how our ancestors would have eaten. Participants who ate this way had better control of their blood sugar, reduced inflammation, lost weight, and shed the dangerous visceral fat around their midriff. They also found that eating earlier was also linked to healthier gut bacteria, which they found aided the immune system and overall health. More data they presented also confirmed that eating earlier in the day improves glycemic control, appetite, insulin resistance, fertility, and once again, significant improvements in weight loss. This study on the 6am to 3pm eating regime found that Western-style diets, which include fat-rich foods and snacks that are consumed around the clock, play a causative role in the development of some chronic diseases. In contrast, our human ancestors did not have continuous access to a food supply. Another clinical trial found eating more calories for breakfast than during later meals saw women lose 5.1 kilogram more weight over a 12-week period. Dr. Courtney Peterson from the University of Alabama warned that grazing throughout the day increases the risk of obesity by 57% and advised sticking to earlier and regular meal times to avoid triggering a form of metabolic jet lag. Quote, most people eat within a 12-hour window, but that time window shifts from day to day. So for some people, that eating window can be 14 or 15 hours, because one day they'll eat breakfast and another day they'll eat really late. We think benefits come when it's the same eating time window each day. The reason for this is you have an internal biological clock called the circadian system. This clock makes you better at doing different things at different times of the day. So for instance, your best muscular strength, greatest reaction time and greatest coordination are in the afternoon. Your highest alertness, testosterone production and in most people best blood sugar control is in the morning. Your body is optimised to do different things at different times of the day. One of the things that's really important about having these optimal circadian rhythms is doing the same thing at a consistent time of day. She added, a great example of this is say you normally go to bed at 10pm and then the next night you're out partying and go to bed at 2am. Even if you're in bed for those same eight hours of sleep, you don't feel as good. That's because your body thinks it has shifted several time zones. You get this sort of feeling of jet lag. There's actually a similar thing going on when you shift your meals from day to day, and we now call that metabolic jet lag. Studies conducted by Dr. Peterson's team actually looked at a timing window of 8am to 2pm and found that this eating regime boosts gene expression and hormone levels, which could explain its anti-aging effects. Participants were also less hungry than on a six-hour eating window later in the day. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below and subscribe for more upcoming videos.